Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Kathy. For today's video, we will be doing a 2024 goal. It is only the 5th of January. So I feel like we're still on track to actually talk and discuss about our 2024 goals. Goals, not resolutions, because we all know Pag resolution yan, most likely it's not gonna happen. It's kind of become a thing where we say, oh, this is my 2024 New Year's resolution. And then after a week, wala na. So we're going to be talking about our 2024 goals. And if you have your own, please go ahead, comment it down below. Let's all be accountable to each other. And then let's revisit this video one year later to see which ones we achieved, which ones we did not, and what happened in between. If this is something that is to your liking, please don't forget to comment, subscribe, like, share. Any kind of interaction is super appreciated by small YouTubers like myself. Okay, we are back. So again, my name is Kathy, and on this channel, we do a lot of unboxing, reviews, first impressions. Um, we talk about journaling, diamond painting, and we also do um, discussions of things that could improve our life, like this one. So today, we are going to be doing the 2024 goals, and I would like to share my goals, not because you guys ask, but because I'm hoping that maybe someone will watch this and then say, oh, you know, I want to do the same thing, or you know, this has been helpful to me. So that has always been one of the goals of my uh, my vlog, which to help someone out. So let's start. One of my first goals is to actually be more visible and more um, active on social media, on my blog, on my vlog. And this is all because I would like to share some of the wisdom that I've earned in the last 43 years of my life. So I am not a life coach. I'm not an expert. But I do have wisdoms here and there that I feel could improve someone else's life. And so I want to share more of that through my channel to hopefully inspire someone, to hopefully help someone change, to hopefully just make things a little bit better. And so that is one of the main reasons why I want to be more active on my socials, blog, and vlog. The other one that I would like to go ahead and do is to actually pay off my St. Peter life plan. And then I'll do another payment on another St. Peter plan. So I don't think it's called a life plan. But it's just a St. Peter plan. I was lucky enough to have met someone who walked me through the entire process. And why do I feel this is important? We all know naman na eventually we're all going to go, you know, through death's door. And I want to make sure that uh, just in case my family won't have a hard time dealing with it um, any more than they should. And this is one of the best ways to go about and do this is to make sure that should anything happen, they can just simply call and someone will handle everything already so that they can focus on their grief. Ay, grief daw. Siyempre naman. I'm hoping naman sana. But they can focus on their emotions themselves and not have to mind kung ano-anong details pa. So that's also one of my 2024 goals is to pay off mine and then add one more. Just so that, you know, it's parang less of a burden, less of something to worry about. Because in 2023, there has been so many deaths that I witnessed. I had to, you know, go to the funeral and I... I realized that I'm not getting any younger and this is something that I really want to be responsible for so that uh, there's just no added burden. And then another goal that I have is to do less of my impulsive spending and to do more of saving. Okay, so it's not like I have a lot of money to save. Um, anyone who knows me knows na talagang if I don't work, if my husband doesn't work, then will be, you know, left with nothing. We have to work for every penny. And we're very grateful to God that we have work to work hard for. But at the same time, I really want to be able to achieve na we'll get to save more. We've been able to save, um, but I would like to save more money and just cut down on the impulse spending. Though my impulse spending naman is mostly like small items. Um... Most of the things that I do buy is needed for the house, for the kids, for the car, or for my mom. Um, rarely is it not for myself. And I'm okay with that. I'm not like, oh, wawa naman ako. Walang ganon, walang ganon. I mean, obviously looking at me, I'm good, I'm okay. 
um i have enough impulsive spending that i did before and i have these things these are like from way way back guys like these um accessories that i've also vowed to start using was from way way back na spending pa and so i just decided na you know i'm gonna take them out and i'm going to use them to put them to good use kaya makikita niyo sa mga videos ngayon may mga ganito akong arte arte um which is another 2024 goal of mine is to utilize what i have so since i have a lot of things i've already given away so many but there are things that uh were left with me and these are the things that i really want to make use of like my accessory cabinet my stationaries i've started using them i've started utilizing them um because they shouldn't just be you know stuck in a corner so ang simple lang naman ang 2024 goals ko actually which is to be more active on my socials and hopefully inspire other people to pay off the two saint peter um plants that i want to get i've already gotten one i want to pay it off and then i want to get another one and then i want to be able to save more because there's something that i really want to purchase for my family and then it's to make use of what i have okay so some of you might say hey how come you don't have like a goal for your family or or whatever for my family i'm so so blessed thank you so much lord that we're in a good spot um and i just kind of want to keep it status quo so uh no like goals goals there except you know just have good health um safety from any kind of harm but everything else my goals is really more on for the external and i'm just hoping that the internal the status quo remains the same now how about you guys what are your goals please let me know i'm curious to know and maybe there's a way for us to help each other out um i want to be accountable to you guys and especially to myself that these are the goals that i have and um Hopefully, I am hoping that I will be able to achieve this because they are achievable and they are doable. Okay, so I hope that you guys enjoyed that very quick um, 2024 goal setting video that of mine. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye!